This video is by Straight Goods News. SGNews. Well, it does. I mean, the reality is I've attended a tremendous amount of uh, uh, veterans' funerals, nursing funerals over the years, and the fact that I was born in Holland and my parents were liberated by these fine men and women. The last thing we can do as a grateful nation is to say thank you for your service to our country. The last time we get to say thank you is at the service. And I've always believed that every single military, and for that matter, RCMP veteran, deserves a dignified funeral. And it shouldn't be half the province, it shouldn't be up to charity, it shouldn't be up to the funeral services to subsidize that. That is the federal government responsibility. And what's happening now? Well, what's right now, reality? for example, uh, if you're a service personnel and you die, you're serving, you you get twelve thousand dollars plus for your funeral. You if you're a, oh, sorry, if you're a service personnel right now, you get twelve thousand, I think five hundred dollars for your funeral service. If you're a veteran, you get thirty six hundred. But only if you qualify. Only if you qualify. There are certain income criteria and legislative criteria you have to meet, which is very difficult to meet. Since 2001, the funeral homes of Canada have been told that that figure is going to rise. Uh, they were told last year by the government it was going to rise. They were told the year before we're going to look at this and fix the problem. And even today, we still have yet to get an answer from the government of when they're going to meet their commitment to ensure that every single veteran who passes away gets the dignified funeral they so rightfully deserve. So if you're a veteran and you die, you only get 3,600 people? Only certain veterans get that. There's a certain criteria. You have to have a, a low enough income in order to qualify. Not every veteran qualifies, which I find rather distasteful because as far as I'm concerned, a veteran is a veteran is a veteran and should all be treated equal when it comes to the benefits. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Very best.